Charlie <laughs> Mating. Charlie's boat. What a lucky bloke. What a ripper boat. Absolutely. Mate, what's the story here? This used to be your boat, I believe. It was my boat. I basically bought it 12 months ago uh, from a guy in the other side of the city. And basically, uh, yeah, it was a little, little bit run down. Yep. Uh, a little bit faded. And I brought it back to its natural glory. I've I done you know, quite a fair bit of work. Mate, this is a very famous hull. This is the original Haynes V17 hull. It is. It's a, it's Has a, it ever been bettered? No. I don't no. think so either. I don't think so. I think it's seriously particularly in its size range, and I'd say probably between you know, 15 and 20 feet. I don't think there's ever been a hull in a size range that'll do anything like this. And John Sadell took it up and built the new cabin and the new deck and perfected it as well. That's yeah. right. Oh, absolutely. Look, everything he's done um, and the way that they've been laid up and the way that they've been built is absolutely amazing. There's no boat that comes close to these, these boats yeah. in the water for their size. Beautiful boats, no yeah. doubt about that. So tell me the story whether this has been propped by Bobcat as well. It has, yeah. Well, basically, this is a this is a funny one. Uh, it's it's actually got a, a 200 litre fuel tank, and the 200 litre fuel tank is right inside the cabin. And this boat was particularly built for twin engines. Yep. So that's why they they built and, and put the in, the fuel tanks all the way forward, so that they could accommodate for two engines on the back with the weight. But um, I, I managed to put a four blade on this, and to be quite honest, I was actually getting too much lift and she was banging a bit. Yeah, okay. So basically, because of the fuel tank and all the weight and the, and the, and the lift that the four blade gives you, yep. I basically went back to a three blade and it's a complete different boat, yep. you know? And then I can go out and do my brother's one, for instance, that's got a, a 150 Merc on it. He's running a four blade okay. because basically he's got a heavier engine. So it's all to do with balance and weight. And weight. And that's what- And propping accordingly. And propping so what did you end up with on this? Is it a well, 17 or a 9 -8? No, it's actually a 21. It's a 21. It's a Gee, double, it'll step out. Yeah, it's a double cup 21. It's a it's a Suzuki 140. It, it, the rev range is right up there. It's at 6.2. Uh, it's good torque. It holds, the prop really holds. I've got extra cupping on it to give you the hold, to give you the lift. Yep. Uh, it's, it's amazing, absolutely yep. amazing boat. The other thing that I'd forgotten about when I said that before also was Suzuki, they've got that step gear drive in them That's as correct. well. That's so correct. you actually go up a step on your props too, don't you? So where normally it would have been a 19, if it had been any other brand of, uh, exactly of, right. of uh, engine, with the Suzuki, because it's a, a stepped up gear case deep, drive. Deep, deep production gearbox. Exactly. Yeah. So it does it does 75Ks. Very oh, okay. Yeah. Yeah. 75. Yeah. It's, not a, it's not a real fast boat, yep. but it, it can do that in very, very big seas. Yep. You know, they're just so capable of, of, of uh, incredible. Yep. The 140 Suzuki has been a wonderful motor. I've loved them. You've owned yeah. a number of them yeah. as, as well. The last <laughs> time we had a bit of fun in the heads with That's your twin 140s. Yeah. Yeah, absolutely. I've never ever got above 30, 33 miles an hour out of any boat that was fitted with a 140 Suzuki until I went for a ride with Peter Bobcat who'd set his boat up and I think we got, what did we get there? 40, yeah, yeah, 40 yeah, we yeah, were doing pretty quick here. Yeah, Absolutely. Yeah. And the performance, the, the difference in the performance was just amazing. So getting that, that power directly transferred into the water with clear stream all the way through is just vital. Exactly right. We're all about the setup. We are. Let's go and see how Charlie's boat goes. Let's go Charlie. It's going to be a good camera boat too. <laughs>